Porsche sports cars are some of the few genuine automotive icons, and for good reason. The race bread handling, the high revving motors, and that design that hasn't really changed much in more than half a century. Now, Porsche is making the biggest changes to its sports cars in decades. Can you see it? No? Well, it's down under there behind these pipes. But you can feel it. Stop, then floor the throttle. It's like they put fireworks up its tailpipe. Porsche in the Cayman is moving to a smaller four-cylinder engine with turbochargers. And it's not just this Cayman S that's changed. Porsche is rolling out the change to every model from the convertible Boxster to the basic 911 to the mighty 911 GTS. Turbocharged Porsches were once reserved for only the wealthiest lawyers and bankers. Now they're for, well, all lawyers and bankers. So why mess with success? The dramatic change is a concession to stricter fuel economy regulations, and it's a strategy being used by everyone from Ford to Ferrari. This news will ruffle the shirts of many Porsche aficionados who are still upset about the move to water-cooled engines in 98. They say turbochargers will ruin the sound, ruin the high revving nature of the engines. I disagree. This turbocharged motor gives more torque lower down, making the car more fun to drive more of the time. The old six-cylinder Cayman didn't come alive until above 4,000 RPM. This new one, despite having two less cylinders, makes more torque from just above idle. The engine feels meatier in everyday driving, whereas the old one was really only at its best on a racetrack or empty Alpine road. The catch? Okay, yeah, it sounds a little bit like a Subaru at idle now.